Hello there. Welcome to Fridays with Tab and Chance. This is the gym edition, okay? Babe, I'm Tab with the Brown. What's up? It's my husband, Chance. <laughs> Bring a beat in. Fridays, Fridays, Fridays with Tab and Chance. Fridays, Fridays, Fridays with Kevin Chance. Hey, man, you don't really tell them here that you are here. Now, you can really, like, I don't know if you want to do it here because you can really hear that, like, you are here. It's all good though. Mm -hmm. oh, but not, I'm not in trouble. <laughs> welcome to Friday's with Tab Chance. So, this is the gym edition. We thought today that we would talk about how he work out versus how I work out. What we even think that working out means. Y'all remember a couple weeks ago? I posted, I chance said, uh, I want an athlete. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ain't that what you said, babe? Don't make me bring the footage because I got I, you care. You know, I said we our definition of what an athlete is is different. Just because you're athletic does not mean you're an athlete. However, but we ain't gonna listen, we're not gonna we're not going to do this. We ain't going back over it. No, I don't feel like going back down that road with you. All right. So, but okay. All right, babe. So, let's talk about working out. What, for, for me, I work out to, like, be healthy, right? Like, I do cardio to make sure my heart is, is well. Um, I, I used to work out back in the day only to lose weight and to look a certain way. That was the only reason I used to work out. Always trying to be small in in, in, in a Hollywood size. That's when Tad went all the way up here, right? Uh, but now, I'm the thickest I've ever been other than being pregnant. And I only work out to be healthy and to feel well. Um, not necessarily to look a certain way. Although, I mean, I like to look good, but I like to feel better. So those are my reasonings for working out. What's your reason for working out, Dad? I mean, I'm all in the same, I'm in the same boat with you, but I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm, I'm a little vain. I like to look good. I want to look good. I want to feel good, and I want to be able to. I still like to play ball with the young guys. I don't want to play with the old men. And in order for me to be able to play, I got to work out. So I, I train for that. You don't want to be old school at the court. I don't want to be old school yet. Hey, <laughs> and, and listen, for my three days, three or four days that I go, I train like um for that. I want to go. But you and I want to be able to keep up with my kids in my program. I can't be out there moving. They, don't, you know, these kids are smart these days. They want to be able to see, as opposed to hearing. You tell them, you know. They don't want to hear what you used to do. They want to know what you can do. <laughs> this is true. Cause yeah. When you say that, do you remember like all the years you played basketball? Did you have coaches who you never got to see them play? Absolutely. <laughs> I never played. I've never played for a coach. Or do I remember playing for a coach that could do anything that he asked of me besides showing up and, uh, I mean, they, you know, those Give things. structure. Yeah, they gave me structure, but in terms of the physical, the, af the athletic stuff. You never saw them play. Never. And in today's world, that's different. You got a lot of coaches that still hoop and are very capable of doing things that are just unbelievable. So I got I to gotta, I gotta keep up. Now, it's one thing that you did not mention. What's that? Why you work out, which is, I know is high on your, on your priority list. What's that? Think about it. what is your 
number one thing that you hate? Oh, I hate losing weight. Oh yeah. yeah. I, oh, that's at the top. That is at the top. So you, I have the curse of if I don't work out, I lose weight. Yeah. I have to work out five, six days a week to maintain this weight. And I have to, and I have to eat five to six times a day. He always hungry. Mm -hmm. He got very Stay high hungry. metabolism. Oh, uh, hungry right now. I'm hungry. He always hungry. He always. Yeah. Hungry. So I probably yeah. You right. And I got that. Uh, what is it called? That re that reverse, reverse metabolism is what they what the doctor calls it. Yeah. Uh, but hey, don't be hating on me. No, I can. I, I, Chance I, lose weight in his sleep, and I wake up thicker. So whatever he lose when he sleep, it find his way to my side of the bed, and I be like, I did, I, I, I went to sleep with hips, thighs, and fries, and I woke up with a whole Big Mac. <laughs> Many people got problems too. Everybody got an issue. Everybody has something that they battle with yeah. their weight, with their appearance, yeah. with their health. Everybody does. So for me, like I said, I work out now <clears throat> to try to stay healthy, right? But there was a time where I did not take care of myself. I only cared about how I looked. So I was doing extreme workout and extreme dieting, very unhealthy to like, you know, try to lose 10 pounds in a week. I gotta, I gotta look this way before this audition or look this way before this shoot. That's the old tab. I would literally be trying to kill myself basically with the things that I would do to try to lose weight. And you, you would always be like, hey, babe, you can't, you can't do it all in one day. <laughs> all in one day. <laughs> yeah, so. You get injured that way and it's unrealistic. It's just not realistic. I, hey, I, hey, look, that made me think about the next <laughs> thing to probably bring up to couples. How many of y'all like working out with your spouse? Do you like working out with anybody? I do like working out with you sometimes. Why? When? So I like working out with you sometimes. <laughs> First of all, I like working out with you sometimes. Because I like when we be having our conversations and stuff. Mm -hmm. And sometimes you'll show me little things. And I'll be like, okay. When we be doing all that talking. No, when you be showing me some stuff. Mm -hmm. When I don't like is when he be trying to tell me stuff that he don't even understand. Chance ain't never had no problem gaining weight. He never had been on the mission to lose weight. And so I be like doing my cardio because I know I need to do cardio. I've had problems gaining weight. Babe, you ain't had problems gaining weight. What I'm saying is you ain't never been like, man, I done gained 15 pounds. That ain't your life or your business. So when I done gain, I be like, I need to lose a little bit. Your workout, me, you ain't, we ain't gonna have the same workout. That's where we have our conflict. But I know, I can tell you one thing. You, you're, you're exactly right. I don't have those same issues, but I know one thing for sure, right. that if you alleviate in both of those, gaining and losing, uh -huh. that good results will come. If you actually do it. I do, I do my workout. When I do so that's so that's the other thing. I, I do long workouts and I enjoy because Chance don't he don't like cardio. Melly Mel. I love cardio, right? I love cardio. Chance he hated. The only cardio he's gonna do is playing basketball. That's, he be like, that's run, run, run he might get on the bike for five minutes. That's to warm up so I can go move. Running is dumb. Running you see, you see, like, he think cardio is dumb. You see that this spoken. Dumb. From a person with the reverse metabolism. You don't you run in your sleep. Your body be over there overheating like he is running a full marathon. In his sleep, wake up three pounds lighter. Me and my sleep wake up three pounds heavier because of him. Okay? Mm -hmm. So that's why. But I do enjoy working out with you sometimes. You know, sometimes we you know, we when during the pandemic, we used to work out a lot together. Yeah. We would we go was, on a little yeah. jogs and stuff, and that was fun. Yeah. I enjoyed that. I don't mind working out with you. I don't mind because I go into see working out in this in company and and working out together is two different things, yeah. right? So if we're working out together, mm -hmm. that means we're doing we're doing we're working on machines together. We we have a common goal. We're you know, yeah, similar exercise. Then in company of you, right? That's something different. Right? Now, a lot of a lot of couples don't know the difference and know how to do it. 
their time is different. You start looking at, I know I start looking at Tab and thinking, and I hear her. I get, sometimes I get offended by the things that she say about herself. My butt is too big, I need to do this, or I need to do that. Or I watch her and she's trying to kill herself all in one day, and I know the next day, the old day. something's going to be hurting. Um, and one thing for sure, you ain't losing none of this hind end that we have grown to love. Over all these okay, years. Okay, so let me tell y'all. We don't lose no, we don't lose no, none of that. That's that's. I it. listen. I'm a brown, but my maiden name is Thomas. Mm -hmm. The Thomas women in North Carolina, in in, in Breezeville, <laughs> Ruffin, we we are known. We got big butts. That's just that's just what it is, honey. Hip thighs and fries, honey, all for the eyes. Okay, mm -hmm. we all got it. And I and I like he hip thighs, fries. Love it all, and I love it. But sometimes I be like, my jeans don't love it. And Tab, you done ate a little too much. I eat for a living, right? I, I, I eat and cook and do all that stuff for a living. And I be like, oh, I, Tab, you got to get in that gym and drop about five pounds so them pants fit right. He be mad. I be no. here doing the extra cry. He talking about, hey, I don't want you to lose that butt. Yeah. However, I will say, that's one of the things I do like about working out with him. Because he, he, he nasty. No, you nasty. <laughs> <laughs> You nasty, and everybody know that. Sometimes hey, she, when she, I'm doing my squats, she don't stay focused. I be liking when he watch. <laughs> <laughs> but he, you know, he might, he might, he might touch me a little bit, and I be like, stop. <laughs> and but I, I like. It. And if I don't, she gonna get him. She gonna come and make herself. No, in I. In my workout circle, to make sure. They know I'm not. That's a distraction. No, I would. I would not do that. I would not do that. <laughs> but listen, that's what make it all fun, right? So, like like we said, sometimes you you love working out together. Sometimes when I'm focused on a mission for myself, I know I can't fool with Chance. I don't even want to argue with him. Mm -hmm. I just need to be in here. Let me get on this treadmill. Let me do my little workout. But what I do like is like when I'm doing something... So, so, shout out to Melissa, okay? She gave me this workout that, that almost killed me, okay? I survived. But it was like a circuit thing. <laughs> <laughs> and so I was in here doing it, and I loved it. When Chance came in here, he was impressed. He was like, dang, baby, you, you going hard, ain't you doing it? And I was doing it for like a week. I was doing it every day, and he was like, I could see him being, like, proud of me. And supportive. Yeah, it's important. I know how important it is to you. Yeah. So I know, you know. And because my schedule changed so much now. Yeah. I used to consistently be able to work out every single morning. Um, and, and that was like my routine prior to the pandemic. But now with my schedule, some days I'm not even home. I'm traveling or whatever. So when I have my little spurts of time where it's consistent, I not come in here and be proud. Yeah, I'm going I'm to support you, baby. need you to be, you know, in sound mind. Yeah. Help us. Yeah. And so I can be I can be uh in shape, you know. That's why right, I got see here you go. You can ready to be nasty. So <laughs> <laughs> you my husband <laughs> You know mm -hmm. these knees ain't what they used to be. I think Tank I think what they did at something they talked about this subject. Who? Working out together. Tank Tank and his uh, wife. Yeah, Tank and his wife. Oh oh and, and Angel. Angel. Oh Tank and Angel, uh -huh. I think he did he talked about this. Oh, about, I ain't see it. Yeah, I, it was a very uh, uh, similar conversation, and he talked about it and, and how y'all go about y'all's workouts, and the distractions that can be called, and where y'all fall that, off. We don't fall off. Y'all be distracting us because y'all nasty. Angel, they nasty. <laughs> <laughs> we be minding our business, trying, yeah. to, trying to get our workout on and stuff, baby. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, that's it. Yeah. Y'all like working out as couples or not? If you work out together as a couple, what are the benefits of it? Uh, what do you love about it? And what do you hate about it? And fellas, keep in mind, uh, or couples, I'm going to give you some points. <laughs> working out together and working out in company, mm -hmm. two different things. That's how you keep the peace. That's how you can keep the peace. If you know 
that you ain't working out because we get a little sensitive about losing weight, gaining weight. You're messing up my reps, man. I ain't got but a few minutes. Do it the right way, man. You ain't doing this. You can avoid those kind of you can avoid those kind of things if you understand the difference between working out together and in company. But also embrace when you know, like I know my husband is a like real athlete. He's very athletic. Say that again. I'm a, I'm a what? You're you're like a real athlete currently. You're still an <laughs> athlete currently. Okay. That doesn't mean I was never an athlete. But I know that you're very serious about working out, and I know that you know more about your you know workouts. So I am open to getting instruction or when he tells me things to try. So if you know one of you has a strength, be open to receiving that information, you know, from your partner. Because at the end of the day, we love each other. And so we want to support each other and help each other. I have actually even showed you some stuff before. Yeah. And he was like, oh, man, I ain't never did that. One thing about Chance, he don't like doing ab workout. He don't like doing sit-ups and he don't like doing legs. And I do those, and he'd be like, man, let me try that. Let me, let me see what you did right there. So we can do, you know, switch it off sometime and, and share those things with each other. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Are we, are we good? We good, baby. I guess we're going to work out. Are we going to work out? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> we're going to work out. What, what time is it? Because we might go. I'm home. Go. Me too. <laughs> Working out we also increases the, you know. There you go. Your drive. See, there you go. Okay, it keeps it healthy, right? When that sweat be dripping off. <laughs> of <your> <laughs> I'm cutting up. I'm gonna get my ashwagandha, but we're gonna go ahead, and finish our little workout, or look, or get started on. It. I did already do my cardio though, uh, so the chance to get some food. But y'all chime in. Let us know. Uh, how y'all feel about Bring working out with your partners? In. What are some tips? Uh, what are some things that you, you know, Friday. love to, to share with us or with everybody else? So, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Until next time, honey, y'all going about y'all business, all right? Have the most amazing day. But even if you can't have a good one, don't you dare go mess with nobody else's here. We love y'all. Bye. <laughs>